Hello, Namul. So it's so wonderful to see you, and I'm so glad that all of y'all are here today. Well, the anthem also features a lineup of the industry's powerhouse and influencers. So from Vidya Balan to Gulzar Sahab, Alia Bhatt, Ayushman Khurana, Shamagrabo himself, Shan, Neeti Mohan, Arman Malik, Ravina Tandon, Stebin, Ben, Isha, they all. There are so many people who have been part of this anthem, and we are truly, truly grateful. Well, today we're also going to be witnessing these wonderful people with us right here on the stage. So, without taking much of your time, may I please invite on stage Mr. Asif Bhamla, Chairman and Founder of the Bhamla Foundation, a non-government organization that works relentlessly towards environment conservation. He's an environmentalist, a philanthropist, a politician. Please welcome Mr. Asif Bhamla. In decent companies, I abstain from saying I'm a politician, actually. <laughs> Anyways, so uh, it's so fabulous to be here with all my very dear and near friends. I, uh, uh, this is the same team. We are back. Uh, you know, uh, uh, Sean, Swanan, and, uh, and Shamak. Actually, all S's, yeah? <laughs> I never knew this. It's very random, actually. And then now we have the E factor also. We have Isha also because she is the face of the interactive video for, uh, for this beautiful uh, campaign. We have Burgess uh, from Godridge, who is uh, very supportive. He comes from a very, uh, very renowned corporate house and who believes in the cause, who believes in sustainability and is a passionate environmentalist. Neeraj Roy, uh, uh, the head of uh, Hangama, has always created Hangama with us. And uh, I mean, uh, uh, I think this combination is now so lethal. And uh, I'm, I'm so happy with Isha joining this combina uh, combination. This will make it much more, it's taking us one more step ahead. Though the song has also many big names, you're all aware, it's opened by, uh, uh, by Alia Bhatt. And uh, in between, you have a number of uh, renowned uh, 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 stars, producer. We have what, uh, for a change, Gunit Monga, who's, um, uh, who's um, an uh, Oscar Award nominee. She's part of the song. We have, uh, uh, we have Ricky Cage, who's uh, a three-time Grammy Award winner. Then we've got Vidya Balan. We've got number of, uh, we've got uh, Arman Malik. So there's so many elements who have been part of the song, and it's come out so beautifully. I mean, the first version of this was, uh, was exceptionally well taken because it was uh, unveiled. We are lucky, Neeraj, that the first uh, one was unveiled by the Honorable Prime Minister in, uh, in, uh, in New Delhi. Uh, this was about six years back, was it? I think, yeah, six years back. And now, again, since the team has come back to plastic pollution, so we are we're continuing with 2-0 tick, tick plastic. And I'm sure this time also is going to create a rave because, uh, I mean, Convincing Gulzar Sahib was like a very big challenge. He's, uh, uh, he, you know, he's such a, he's such a visionary, and he's, uh, I mean, Swananji is uh, aware about it. Or when I said that, then Swananji also felt a little shock that Asif has done what he has done. So I said, I use all the names and that this is also, this is also, and I also said that you are also a part of it. And well, the environment has been a forte, like she mentioned. We've been here. Well, the environment has been a forte, like she mentioned. We've been here. Our foundations now, by the grace of God, 25 years, we've been consistently working. I have a team, of course, which leads that, uh, you know, they say, hum ne kaha ke chale the, hum akele, aur sare mil gaye, itna bada karwa ban gaya, itna bada parivar ban gaya, hamara ke har rajya mein, hamare pariyavaran prem karne wale, uh, eco champs, youngsters, millennials, ye sare ikatta ho kar, ek, itna bada ek, uh, you know, uh, a, a association, ho gaya, a, you know, that I have no words. We did the uh, beach, uh, we have the beach cleanups, the mangrove cleanups. These are all uh, the, the segregation of garbage, the biogas plant. So they're all various verticals of the foundation which have been happening, and all of them have been a witness to it from uh, so many years with my team. I would like to start with, of course, uh, Romanchak. I'd like you all to give him a very big hand. Romanchak Aurora, he's not here. वो जब वो eyeballs और credibility की बात लेने की आती तो वो खुद ही छुप जाता है, so he's anyways in his hiding. But a very big hand to Ramanchak Arora for curating this campaign. 
And of course, uh, my CEO, Meraj Hussain, is here. Very big hand of applause for him. We have Bhavin, who, is, who has done a fabulous job in curating this uh, whole technically. Uh, he's lost a lot of hairs, I mean, from the time he started off, because we've been on him, on him all the time. I have my lovely daughter, Seher, who's also the brand ambassador. With the, he works with the United Nations Environment Program. So it's all been a very, very, uh, uh, very fabulous team of the young, the experienced, the technocrats. Uh, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a fabulous combination. And I'm grateful to God that they and I just hope that I'm able to take this mission forward too. We are thankful that the Honorable Prime Minister made a mention of our beach cleanup drive uh, in his monkey bar. So that's something which is, uh, you know, uh, which makes us feel proud. He has tweeted uh, the, the work that we have done. Uh, in fact, Seher ka jo dal lake ka cleaning tha, uh, it caught the imagination of the Honorable Prime Minister. So ye sari cheeze hain jo hume thoda sa, this is just to, uh, to give us more encouragement to work more towards this. And we are, we are happy that we have a prime minister who's so passionate on environment. When he talks from the red fort, he speaks on, on, on climate change. He speaks on climate change mitigation. He speaks on sustainability. So that is one common agenda globally with all countries and all leaders also. And I'm thankful that we are all here. Thank you so much for having us. Thank you so much. I'd like to also invite on stage Mr. Burgess Godrich. Please welcome him, the Executive Director of Godrich Agrovets, Mr. Burgess. Godrich is a passionate advocate for sustainability, guys. With his extensive expertise and leadership, he plays a pivotal role in driving sustainable initiatives within the organization. Now, that is something that we definitely need. So thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much. It's really a great pleasure to be here. We're all gathered here with a lot of enthusiasm to celebrate the launch of the Tick Tick Plastic 2.0 Anthem. This is a musical initiative aimed at combating plastic pollution, collaboration between Godrej Industries, Bhamla Foundation, and Hangama Music to really highlight our shared commitment to raising awareness about this very important and very urgent environmental issue. So I'll just state some facts from OECD's Plastic Outlooks report. It's not too long. I don't want to bore you too much. But plastic consumption has quadrupled over the past 30 years driven by growth in emerging markets like India. So global plastics production has doubled from 2000 to 2019. It's now at 460 million tons. And plastics accounts for about 4% of all greenhouse gas emissions. So plastic waste generation has more than doubled. Two thirds of plastic waste comes from plastic with lifetimes of under five years, 40% from packaging, 12% from consumer goods, 11% from clothing and textiles. So we really need to work together to improve circularity on this. So an international approach to waste management should lead to more financing, development aid, mobilized to help low and middle income countries meet the estimated costs of 25 billion euro a year to improve waste management infrastructure. And you're getting support from so many esteemed institutions, Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change in India. India is hosting the G20 this year, so it's a great platform to spread awareness about this and the UNEP, UN Environment Programme. So our collective efforts will have a profound impact and pave the way for a plastic-free future. So at Godrage, we're very deeply committed to reducing waste across all our plants, offices, products, and supply chains. We adhere to an Indian extended producer responsibility laws, and we collect back all the plastic waste we generate. However, we go beyond whatever is required for compliance, and we collaborate with civic agencies, social enterprises, and citizens groups to promote reuse and recycling. We've set very ambitious goals to decarbonize. We've become net zero for scope one and two emissions. By 2035, we will be aligning with the global science-based targets initiatives. And we have recycled over 24,000 metric tons of post-consumer plastics. We send approximately 38,000 metric tons of waste from our plants for recycling. And around a fifth of that is plastic waste. Thank you. We want to inspire more companies to do this and follow in our footsteps. Through our CSR projects, we made a significant impact in waste diversion and recycling. And we're exploring alternate packaging materials like bioplastics. What can we do with that? How can we make them more heat stable, for example? Increasing the use of post-consumer recycled plastic to reduce our reliance on virgin plastic. Furthermore, our employees are actively participating in many volunteering initiatives like the Global Godrej Volunteering Day. And we're doing environmental awareness campaigns, tree planting activities, cleanliness drives, many different activities. 
So on this World Environment Day coming up on 5th June, we urge everyone to join us in this movement. Let's use plastics responsibly, let's recycle appropriately, and let's support sustainable initiatives like this one undertaken by the Bhamla Foundation. Together, all of us working together, we can create a better future for our planet. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for that thoughtful message. And I want to call you three people who have been such important people for not just giving us a message, but giving us a message through music, through lyrics, and through a lot of dance. So please welcome Ooh. the ever-smiling Shan, the wonderful Swaran Kirkire, and Shah Magdawar. Please please all of you all together. Aye, aye. The man of few words first. Let, let's dance is going to happen now, but before that, okay, please welcome Aisha the old guys, ladies and gentlemen. Acha, she will murder everyone if you call her Isha. It's apparently Aisha. Aisha the old. And she gave me a lovely, lovely little joke today. She says, you know, I'm called Ed, 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 but now no one wants to call me Ed. So that we remember this, I want all of you all on the count of one, two, and three to say Asia, okay? Yeah, ready? One, two, and three. Asia. Now we'll never forget. Never. <laughs> so, I will ask you first, Swanan Ji, you start with Tell us, this was Tick Tick Plastic 2.0. We have... 2.0, whatever is Shan, the rest of the is not old. Nothing has changed. Uh, so the song uh, we had six years ago. The song was also in recycling. And I didn't write a lot of it. So, but uh, but yeah, uh, I'm working with Asip Bhai and Neeraj Sir. It's fun. It's fun. It's fun. It's a yearly event. This has become. And uh, I'm just passionate with it. Every year. It's amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. 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 Wonderful. Shan, please tell me, how was your experience with this? I think that Shan didn't like any lines, so I put it in the middle of it. I put it in the middle of it. Which ones were the lines? I don't know. I don't know. Actually, first they write, then there is a composition. It's like that so far. But actually, even this time, we had planned a whole new song. Keeping the hook the same, we had planned new words where we would talk more about the solution, plastic pollution, than the situation. But, there were some new plans. And I said that the song was already pretty catchy. You know, in schools, people all... Come and listen. You said the mouth of the mouth, Neeraj Ji. The main line, which is Shama's line, is that it's the same with the song. Refuse, reduce, reuse, recycle. We also have recycled with the song. This is a new reward. Plastic wale smile sare chhod kar Aao khul ke muskurai re Tick, 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 tick Kasam ye khai re Tick, 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 tick Plastic tick na paai re Tick, 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 everybody tick, tick Kasam ye khai re Tick, 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 tick Plastic tick na paai re that was wonderful. Like, yeah, bad hai. No, we are going to, we are all going to dance with uh, Shamakdaw for sure. But I'd like to ask Asia Deol. Yeah. <clears throat> oh wow! Five, five <laughs> points for that. Thank you. <laughs> How was it taking the lead on an interactive video and being a part of such an important project? You know, um, I think the Bhamla Foundation has existed for more than twenty-five years. Uh, we've all uh, watched them very closely. And uh, today I feel, uh, you know, we are not just pretty faces. We have a purpose behind that as well. And uh, with this face, if I'm able to give out a wonderful message, you know, about uh, plastic pollution and the various, uh, you know, subjects he, he takes upon to save our environment, why not? Also, being a parent today, it's my responsibility. And I think it's so lovely that they've come up with such a catchy song because I can see my girls singing and dancing to it. And through it, they're going to learn so much more 
Uh, I think it's a wonderful approach, and I'm really, really, uh, you know, grateful and honored to be part of this movement. Uh, so my best wishes, and you always have my support. Thank you. May I also add that Aisha was leading the interactive videos, and we've got a video that we'd love for everyone to see on what Aisha had to say. If you could just oh, see the video, okay. please. That was wonderful. Thank you so much. Aye. Thank you. Isha, thank you so much for that message. Thank you. Aye, Shant Swanan ji. Kahan chale gaya aap? Ab to main hai, ab to main hai. Kyunki ab to. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, please give it up for the man who's made us dance to his wonderful choreographies for years and years together. I don't know how many people are there who were in their summer vacations and we would love to go to that place. So please, please put your hands together for Shyam Mukhtar. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. How was your experience? How was your experience on being part of, of such a wonderful initiative? You know, um, Mr. Bhamla has been my friend for, I think it must be 30 years. At least 30 years, Bandra, hanging out. Then one day he says, I'm doing this whole thing on plastic. I said, <laughs> no, I'm, I know age, but what to do now? I'm still beautiful, so it's okay. So, my darling, thank you. So, you know, when he came up to me and said, this plastic thing, I said, what plastic? I have no idea what you're talking about. And they said, you know, this and that. And I said, oh, that way. I said, yeah, we should do something. And then he said, Shan's on board. Now, I love Shan from another 50,000 years. So, and he's a lovely singer. Uh, and I just think he's a lovely guy. So when, you know, he associated with Shan, I said, okay, this is a clean, lovely guy. I want to be associated in this way. And anything to do with selflessness, where it comes to doing something, I would do it anyway. So Asip was very happy having a mean laugh right now because my show got cancelled on the 5th and I was going to not come. He said, oh, I'm very happy. I said, my show. <laughs> so, so anyway, I'm there on the... F yeah, I know. So I, uh, so we, so Sean made the music with him, of course, and we did the whole song, and uh, it was uh, so catchy. And all my students all over the world, and I'm not just saying it like this. It's a nice song, huh? It's a nice song, huh? I said, obviously it's a nice song. It was quite catchy, yeah. I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was a lovely, it was a lovely process of all of us uniting. So thank you, Neeraj and my Godish, my friend, my sweetie, my Burgess, who's my cousin also somewhere. Uh, his mother is my cousin actually. So. And uh, so I'm just saying it's a lovely family. And this little girl here is a very hardworking girl. Say, you, no, no, no. I'm just saying the truth. You've been, I've been watching you. The way I watch Shahid, Bamani, Rani, all, and I brought them into the industry. I've seen you. Because I saw talent. And I can see talent very fast. And no, I'll tell you what it is. It's your heart. And you know why? Because you keep quiet and do it. And that's the best way to do it. So big hand for it. Your office agrees, but everyone knows that all of you do it with... See, all of us are all heart. If you see, we're all the same. You Why know? don't you just join us here? We're talking about you. No, seriously. I, come, come, I'm come. Quickly. Very proud of you, darling. And that is why I say it openly. Quickly come, say hi, and then leave. <laughs> and very persuasive like you. Persuasive like you. No, first she'll come here, and then she'll... Come quickly. 
But Neeraj, thank you for Angama because you know we need platforms, yeah, and it's really All nice. All right, chalo. Ab, ab, now that you are here, two words, please. Tick, tick, plastic. That's two words. Three words. No, you've been doing a very good job. Tell thank everyone. You. Thank you. You're very kind with your words, Shamas. But I'm doing my bit. You know, we are the future of our nation, and we are supposed to be concerned about issues that affects our society. And environment is a topic. We all are living in the environment. And if it's devastated, I don't know what's going to happen. Yeah. Then there's no point of this. So we better protect our mother nature and do our bit. And please don't use plastic. It's the worst thing possible. Single use plastic is so bad and we don't even realize it. We use it once for 15, 20 seconds and then we end up throwing it. But it's in our environment for 500 years. So I don't see anything good in that. Yeah, that's it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So before we before we watch the video, uh, the final thing that we would definitely want to learn is from Shamak Dawar is the hook step. So I don't, everybody I don't even remember it. I've forgotten it because hey, everybody tick, remembers. Tick 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 something. I forgot. Malum hai kuch? So we work. First, let's watch the video. 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 Could we please have the video? But one minute, one minute, one minute. Let's just have somebody more also important. Please, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Neeraj Roy also. Then <laughs> now you have to come. Managing director and founder of Hangama Media, please. We definitely want. After the video, we were in any case going to get him to dance with us. So I said, Chalo, pehle. Ek baar phir se Come on, everyone. Okay. Uh, thank you for embarrassing me. <laughs> Always. But, uh, uh, no, very quickly, not to take away from uh, whatever has already been said, but uh, I read somewhere that uh, sort of the environment is not something that we inherit from our ancestors. We actually borrow it from our children. And I think in that sort of one line, you get a sense of uh, how dire and how serious this is. Uh, about 15, 20 years back, uh, when the conversation around this uh, was just about starting, you know, there were the skeptics of, is this real, not real? I think that debate is far, far over. The last three COP summits between 25, 26, 27, which happened in Sherman Sheikh, is already suggesting that there has been a 1.2 degree increase. What was to happen in 2040 is likely to happen in 2030. What is really, really uh, sort of something for all of us to be conscious and aware about is the fact that India is currently in the top 10 nations in the world where environmental disasters are likely to happen because of the kind of topography and the area that we are in as well. So in the midst of all of this, as Burgess was saying, you know, plastic pollution just happens to be one of those uh, close to about 300, 350 million tons of, you know, production that happens. More than 50% of that, as I had mentioned, is single use. And only currently about 6% of it is actually getting recycled. Almost about 9 million tons is made, being made uh, into our oceans, into our seas each year. And that, if it were to sustain, by 2050, you will have less marine life and more plastic in, in the oceans. So there are all of these reasons. And I think the role of this entire initiative is to simplify the message. And what we started six years back as a interesting, well, well, sort of, you know, scripted and, and, and uh, the, the kind of lyrics that captured the imagination with the sort of music and the combination of Swanand and Shan that was put together. This time around, the big difference is we are suggesting solutions, simple solutions. It's what Aisha spoke about in her video. You know, uh, don't use plastic straws. Simple things that any one of us can do because that is where you start the process of, you know, reduce 
reuse, and recycle. So I think, you know, my only message is that we as a digital media company, uh, we're not just sort of delighted to be a part of this. We feel it our responsibility. And the good thing is that with the kind of network that exists, we are, we are going to be involving every telecom company, mainstream device companies, all the record labels. So potentially looking at trying to accelerate this to as many people. And no better message than the video that you will see. It is simple, it's catchy, it is the, the last one, just for the record, I mean, the num thousands of schools where this video has been played, Shama. It is, it is really, it's, it's pretty much become like the anthem of sorts towards the environment. So once again, my eternal gratitude to the original sets of people, Swanan, Shan, for your involvement in this. Shamak, you know, you've been absolutely an integral part of this all along. Burgess, uh, be rest assured, you're gonna be sort of joined to the hip and uh, our partner in progress for the next few decades. And, and we sincerely appreciate uh, your support. Isha, uh, you know, you said, spoke from the heart because it is for our children. The first thing is we're just, we're just borrowing this planet from our children. So it's really that. And Sahir and the wonderful team at Bhamla Foundation, thank you. And I do want to make one message towards my team. You know, Somini and the entire team, every time they take up this, uh, you know, we, we do it with, there is no commercial motive for us. We are just deeply, deeply as a company, this is an aspect that we are committed to and we're really thankful uh, to, to be a part of this here. Thank you so Thank much, you. Asif. Thank you so there. much. Thank you. And let's now have a look at the video, ladies and gentlemen. We must act, commit, and set new norms now to eliminate plastic. This World Environment Day, join us in this global effort to beat plastic pollution and to find eco-friendly solutions to plastic pollution. Let's tick tick plastic from our lives. <laughs>
बात नास्तिक की भी नहीं ये बात प्लास्टिक की है प्लास्टिक का इस्तेमाल इंसानी जुर्म है पाप है ये हमारी आबो हवा ही नहीं हमारी मिट्टी पानी को भी खराब करता है प्लास्टिक न जलकर खत्म होता है न दफन होकर इसका इस्तेमाल बंद कीजिए जो जमीन तबाह करता है वो जिंदगी भी तबाह करेगा ये सिर्फ हमारी नहीं सारी दुनिया की आवाज है was so impactful thank you so much ladies and gentlemen i request all our esteemed guests to please join me back on stage लगता है मैसेज बहुत क्लियर है सो इम्पोर्टेंट सो थैंक यू सो मच यस ओ यस यस हेलो फज मेरा सवाल कोई भी आंसर कर सकते हैं uh, जिस तरह पैकेजिंग होती है फोर्टी परसेंट ऑफ पैकेजिंग से ही प्लास्टिक आती है क्या लगता है जो पैकेजिंग कितना इम्पोर्टेंट हो जाता है पैकेजिंग को स्टॉप करना क्योंकि अगर पैकेजिंग स्टॉप हो जाती है तो ऑलमोस्ट प्लास्टिक स्टॉप हो जाता है तो हम बायोप्लास्टिक का इस्तेमाल कर सकते हैं आई थिंक द गुड थिंग विद दैट इज दैट यू इट्स नॉट अ पेट्रोकेमिकल इट्स यू नो ऑफ नेचुरल ओरिजिन सो दैट्स अ गुड ऑल्टरनेटिव फॉर प्लास्टिक एंड वी हैव आवर ओन इनिशिएटिव द मैजिक लाइन वेयर वी आर जस्ट कीपिंग द प्रोडक्ट इटसेल्फ विदाउट वाटर सो वी यूजिंग हाफ एज मच प्लास्टिक एज नॉर्मली इज यूज्ड इन द एफएमसीजी इंडस्ट्री सो दैट इज आल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो वी हैव टू चेंज पैकेजिंग यूज लेस पैकेजिंग स्मॉलर पैकेजिंग सैशेस एंड दैट विल सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम no every mic before it comes in they will put it in a plastic bag then you rip off the plastic and then you'll use it now you keep yourself there in the name of hygiene in the name of cleanliness i think they really push it in every product is getting packaged three or four times today you take a product out of any packaging there's a packaging outside the first cover then you take that out there's something more inside so i think at some point even as company policy we have to start saying that kabhi product itna aur uska packaging itna hai yes we have to you know have some put some sense we're just pushing and promoting companies that are creating one time use plastic so you know if we order online something yeah i think i think a lot of uh, you know there should be laws put out for companies who use products with excess packaging to not allow that to happen i think that's 
can be done and should be done. Uh, starting a movement, if you see, this was taken up very, in a very strong way uh, uh, five years back. In fact, Maharashtra was the first state to ban plastic. The reason why maybe the UN has taken this up is because this is getting more serious. Uh, you know, I mean, I'm, uh, I don't know if I should say that the countries like America, it doesn't matter, plastic or environment, unko to, unko to padha hi nahi, unko. but when it comes to Europe, if you see, they've become very conscious of, of plastic. And India, may, Maharashtra was the first state to do the banning. But now, I, I just recently happened to, just yesterday, meet the Honorable Chief Minister. After the fifth, uh, knowing that there is more usage happening, I think the UN has also come up with a scheme again. Otherwise, you will never see a theme being repeated, uh, you know. So again, because this issue is be becoming ye critical, ho hai, crucial, this is why this theme ko, uh, kiya ja ra, is dobara is mein awareness is to abhi, abhi governments, jo hai, because I'm sure uh, 5th Tariq ko Adhani Pandha Pradhan bhi Delhi mein is par ek bhoot bada conclave karne ja rahe, life jo uh, government of India ke saath ek bhoot bada uh, conclave hai, lifestyle environment, to wo uh, vaha honne ja rahe, हर राज्य को ये इंस्ट्रक्शन दिया है कि इस पर जो है अमल बजावनी होनी चाहिए इस पर बैन लगना चाहिए दुकानों में अन्य जगहों पर जहां भी इन फैक्ट व्हेन आई मेट यस्टरडे द ऑनरेबल चीफ मिनिस्टर ही वाज वेरी फोकस्ड ही हैज कॉल्ड हिज एंटायर टीम एंड देयर इज अ प्रॉपर रोल मैप दैट्स गोइंग टू बी हैपनिंग जैसे स्विगी है जोमैटो है हमने खुद ने एज एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन वी हैव रिटन टू देम दैट इसके बाद आप लोग खुद ही डिलीवरेबल्स मत करिए ना फॉर पैकेजिंग्स जो आप लोग होम टू होम डिलीवरी करते हो you all yourself curtail from de delivering products which are in, which are using uh, single use plastic so how will you, how will the, uh, the products reach at home so there are various way khair har cheez ek din mein aur ek waqt mein nahi hoti lekin mujhe aisa lag raha hai ke every every small act counts and uh, uh, i think we are on for that and the the reason why gyan se ab log thak gaye is sangeet ke madhyam se isko ek khoobsurat Hello. Uh, I have a question for everyone uh, on uh, digital media and social media. While we are doing this initiative with whole hearts, you know, there are still a lot of people who troll online. And I would like to ask everybody that how would you deal with online trolling? Like, what, how would you handle it basically? Very simple. Before, when we had no phone, with word of mouth. Trolling is just a button you press and you say what you have to say. It takes no effort. Maybe the person doesn't even have that khunnas on you. It's just a become, it's become a habit. So the only thing that you can do, at least I do, I don't advocate this way, is I just focus on the positive. I don't give negative how. So I take out the negative and say, okay, maybe that's their point of view. But I know what I'm doing inside now for skin up for me. So that's the only way. Your thought has to be very positive. If you're doing something that doesn't hurt anybody and doesn't hurt you, you're fine. I can't understand why anyone would want to troll such a good initiative that's, you know, helping the environment, keeping generations, you know, alive for the future, improving the cleanliness of our surroundings. I just cannot understand that. It's shame on them if they want to troll such a thing. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. I can't, I mean, people troll everyone, but there's no, they absolutely, yeah, nobody should troll at all. But this initiative, I absolutely cannot understand why anyone would want it. Like there are various, of course, you know, there, there's plastic pollution, there's air pollution, there's water pollution. There is this sort of a pollution of the mind these days that too everyone's much. too skeptical, too, too cynical. Much. Everything is a conspiracy theory. Everyone thinks, oh, yeah. this is what So, you know, people have stopped believing that there have people who would want to do something good from the good of their heart. So, you know, it's, it's a thing. Like, like Shamak said, you can't do anything about that. The only way we can do is don't spread that pollution. So by, by confronting it or, you know, kind of talking about it, you're spreading it further. It's best to let it die quietly. Stop single-use trolling. I've, I've, I've had <laughs> personal, um, I've done it and I've realized it with my own personal experience. Trying to, you know, I've tried to respond to trolling and I've gotten into big trouble there. As, <laughs> as I'll, I'll, you just add, I'll just add one thing. Uh, trust me, knowing digital media, knowing the numbers, etc., that are there, 
you'd be amazed at the amount of value <laughs> that we seem to as ascribe to these trolls, etc. Several of them would have, you know, like would have started some initiative or started their social journeys two days back, four days back, or whatever. So don't give it so much importance. Say what uh, Shamak said, be positive, and a very simple thing, ignore, you know. Sir, I have a question. Uh, we are talking about uh, plastic, uh, reducing plastic wastage. We have experts on singing, choreography, acting, politics. You meet so many people, your counterparts from the industry. So if you have to re tell like people you have actually seen from the industry who actually save plastic, like they don't use a glass because it has plastic. So if you have to name two, three people, starting from uh, Shan sir, and we can just like... <laughs> Like no, no, I think like, like yeah. an example you gave, this needs to be educated. We are talking about single-use plastic. We're not talking about, a, like, like I'm wearing spectacles, I'm wearing glasses, yeah. and these, I'm going to be wearing them for, for like, what, as long as they last. Correct. But it's not single-use. It's something that you use and you throw. Correct. That is what we are talking about as pollution. I mean, if you have a bucket, a plastic bucket, it's very good. You're saving water. Correct. Instead of, you know, having a shower every day, I, I'm, you know, for the last few years now, I, I bathe out of a bucket because that way I, I save. So that I'm using it. So uh, we are not against plastic, but single-use plastic. So that awareness, before yes. we tell our friend, we should tell you also. I think <laughs> uh, just one more thing, but any people from the Of course, like, you know, like there's water. Every time you go to a, yeah. you go to a studio, they, you know, they give you a pet bottle. Carry your own water. I carry my own water. Yeah. There are so many things. You can keep a small garbage bin in your bag. So in case, you know, you, you're snacking or whatever, instead of, you know, just uh, you, you keep it with you and then you can put it into the recycling space. I think in the last uh, four or five years, I am seeing a lot of change in macro levels also. Take up Mumbai airport is now plastic free. Yeah. You go to so many hotels now where they don't, they give you water in, in glass bottles. Give your horrible straws that you still have them. They break every time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but those, yeah, those, those, those paper, paper straws are back. So yeah. Starbucks is doing it. Even straws are, uh, you know, like everywhere. True, true, true. Just throw a ucha karke pee you know. So we can go back to the 70s, you know, when plastic was not actually that mass produced. Life was beautiful. It was fine. Think of all the things that we did when, okay, not everyone can think of things we did in the 70s. Okay. We are giving away our age now. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 yeah. Anyway, we are from the 70s, yeah. Question for Shamak. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. If you had to create a dance uh, sequence for the Paradise Illusion household prop, done. Okay, so what would you use? Are everything, would everything. You name it, I would use everything from the kitchen utensils to everything. Ja I, I have done it. In in during COVID, we used a song with the jhadu. We used a song with the uh, you know the the yeah. Balan Balan. We used are lots of these. Uh, uh, glass bottles, tuck, 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 tuck. We made songs out of them. We used, I've used, uh, you know, when I was to choreograph and I couldn't afford costumes at that time, I swear we took curtain materials, I took film roll, I took things to make, uh, you know, how do I say, costumes out of. I literally did that because we didn't have the money that time to start anything. Even my props were made out of just things I would find. And if you see, you see in my shows, earlier shows, you'll see all those props made from just, you, I love the question, thank you. Yeah. Very sweet Very question, I like it. Thank you. What a sweet question. Oh, one last question. Uh, I'd like to ask that uh, there are so many celebrities who are involved in this initiative. How do you think, you know, social media is supporting or how celebrities can take the initiative in terms of social media to interact with, you know, their fans? I think everyone has been, in fact, I think I think I said that while I was here already, you know, that, uh, you know, j having a popular name, if you're able to utilize it for something that is only going to help your future generation and keep our environment intact. And honestly, I feel also, uh, you know, like him, if there, there, I'm sure there are many more people who are working towards something like this. So, we need to join hands with them and make sure that it's happening. And I'm sure, uh, you know, sooner or later, we will see a brighter future. And if it's through social media, which 
you know, is the, uh, you know, way of, uh, you know, showcasing talent or publicizing things today. Why not use that as a medium? Just because of few uh, hiccups that they have doesn't mean we, we step back. We are here in full force with full support for him and we are going to make sure that it reaches every nook and corner in whatever way possible. Through a song, through social media, through all of us being here today. I, will, I would like to uh, answer this also uh, in support and extend to what uh, Isha said. Stars are role models of millions. If you the media, I think glamour quotient that you have so many numbers. I am so surprised because normally a lot of people ask me that every year you do it and every time there is either Bhoomi Pednekar, Aishman, all the film industry people have been connected to me for the last few years because of course I reside in an area where all the stars reside and come from. So they all do it, as I said, pro bono, giving everything for them selflessly. So, if these stars are not, then the media doesn't cover it. How many on-ground events we have every year, the beach cleaning drive. Every week we have a beach cleaning drive. Every week we have mangrove drive. We have drives where we segregate garbage. Our teams go to them. They never look at the media. When I say to myself, this is a real job. This is a way of optics that we are doing. But real calm, if you can see, the stars are doing their own bit. They are always giving their time. They are always giving everything to them. But people who are doing on-ground work, the media should also highlight them, their work, which it doesn't. I'm not against anybody in particular. But that is true work, which also has to be highlighted. These highlights will also be done. Because Isha Ji, when she will share on her digital platform, she's got millions of followers. Uh, Godrej as a corporate is sharing it anyways, so it's getting great traction. Shamak is going to sh is share it and is sharing. Uh, uh, Shan is, Swananji, a number of actors now. We've got Ali. Everybody will share this. So that multiplication, jo star power mein hai, unfortunately, that's not in any other, uh, in other, other case. And I think we are proud of uh, our film industry. And I am, from the depth of my heart, very thankful that everybody has done this I think that if it's for a film or if it's commercially, then it will be more than the heart of it. As far as it is posted, it will be in front of me. I mean, Isha's managers called me twice. Mansi, I'd like to thank her also. She's here. She's called me twice. So when do we post the sound bites or radio? I said, no, we'll post it tomorrow. So, you know, that is... That is the amplification and the support that we're getting, and I'm very thankful to all the stars. And this means a lot because it gets viral. The virality of a content will happen. Ye logo tak pochane ka kam ini ini adakaro or stars or singers in ke madhyam se hoga. Or that is what we should do. Also, I want to say one thing to you is that you know we have to get. I just came from the IPL. I just did some. I did a show there. My God, the love for cricket is so powerful. We should get cricketers to do this. If we cricket did, people, had, if last year we had Sachin was yeah, the face of the yeah. campaign, so we should get like we had Sachin every team of IPL to do this. <laughs> no, seriously, because cricket is very powerful, don't you see? I know, but that's a great platform to spread the word. Cricketers are phenomenal today yeah, in yeah. India. Always has been. Yes, yeah, Sachin also you all used. But I'm saying, get even the young ones who everyone relates to. You know, get the legends. Of course, you're getting. Yeah, but there's the legends. I'm saying get even the youth, the ones who are the, the younger lot, you know. Yeah, so the youth connects with them. Not that they, Sachin is a god, there's no question. But also the younger ones, you know. It will really help. Because cricket and, cricket and Bollywood, there's nothing more. And good thoughts. On that note, thank you so much once again. We're so happy that on this platform. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, thank you once again. We're so glad that on this platform, Agale Saal ki planning bhi ho gai hai, which is so important. Uh, we'd also request all our kind guests to please be on stage while we uh, have someone to give a token of appreciation. Zera, are you here? Ajaye. Thank you so much, Tushan. Ladies and gentlemen, ek bar zor dar taliya, Tushan.
Thank you so much, Shamak Dawa. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, once again, what's her name? Aisha Deol. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mr. Asif Bamla. Mr. Burgess Godrich, thank you so much. Thank you for all the good work in the background. And, uh, yeah, well done, yeah. Thank you so much, Neeraj Roy. <laughs> and Swanan ji, bahut bahut shukriya. Thank you so much, Swanan Kirkire. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for being a part. We'll see you all on 5th of June on World Environment Day. Thank you. Good night and drive safe. जिस तरह का इनिशिएटिव है तो मुझे पर्सनली काफी अच्छा लगा आप अगर कुछ बताना चाहो कितना इम्पोर्टेंट हो जाता है इस तरह का इनिशिएटिव में बीइंग अ पार्ट जी ये बहुत ही इम्पोर्टेंट इश्यू है इसीलिए इसे इतना सपोर्ट भी मिल रहा है फ्रॉम द यूएन from the government of India, from the you know environment for the from the environment programs and all, and as artists, हमारा एक जिम्मेदारी होता है कि हम इस किस्म के you know program को support करें और जितने लोगों को पहुंचा सके हमारे आवाज से हम जरूर करेंगे क्यों नहीं और ये खास करके आज जो problem है आगे जाके multiply ना हो तो जितना छोटा सा भी effort is a big effort for our future generations also. जैसे हम जानते हैं मैं बॉलीवुड में इतने सेलेक्स हैं, उन सब को साथ में लेके चलना कितना हार्डवर्क रहता है, इसके बारे में वो सवाल इनके मेरे लिए नहीं है। इन सब को अगर आपने दिल से बुलाया और वो जब कॉज उन्हें हमने बताया, तो मुझे लगता नहीं कि उन्होंने अपने इतने बिजी शेड्यूल के बावजूद भी उन्होंने सब कुछ छोड़ के अभी शान का आज इनका रिकॉर्डिंग था इन्होंने कहा कि नहीं आसिफ भाई एक अच्छा काम है मैं इसमें सहभाग होने के लिए अपनी रिकॉर्डिंग कैंसिल करूँ ऐसे कई एक्टर्स हैं जो अपना शूट कैंसिल करके उसके पहले हमारे पास अभी हम अक्षय कुमार थे तीन साल तो उन्होंने अपनी शूटिंग पर शूटिंग बंद करके इसकी शूट किया उन्होंने डेढ़ डेढ़ दो घंटा शूट किया और हमें दिया बिना कोई स्वार्थ के तो ऐसे नहीं है अगर अगर उन्हें आपके काम में भरोसा है और विश्वास है तो यकीन है आप देखो आप प्लास्टिक अब मैं उस दिन क्या सारे स्टूडियोज में अगर आप देखो कि फिल्म स्टूडियोज में भी तो उधर बाहर लिखा है बड़ा ये प्लास्टिक फ्री शूटिंग जोन शूटिंग जोन बहुत आई वाज देख मैं कपिल शर्मा को मिलने गया उधर उन्होंने बाहर लिखा हुआ था प्लास्टिक फ्री जोन तो इस किस्म से इसका इस पर अमल हो रहा है हर लेवल पर स्टेज है शान यू हैव बीन इंस्पायरिंग सो मेनी पीपल बाय योर सॉन्ग और एक नया गाना जिससे आप फिर से इंस्पायर करने वालों कितना इम्पोर्टेंट हो जाए तो पर्सनली आप किस तरह बिलीव करते हो कि कंप्लीटली मैं कंप्लीटली ये वर्ड इसलिए यूज़ कर रहा हूँ कंप्लीटली नो जीरो प्लास्टिक क्योंकि महाराष्ट्र ने बैन किया है ऑलरेडी बट कम्प्लीटली बैन करना कितना इम्पोर्टेंट हो जाता है नहीं देखिए इससे पहले एक अभियान से मैं जुड़ा था गुटखा सिगरेट तम्बाकू के विरुद्ध उसके बाद महाराष्ट्र में बैन भी हुआ उस चीज़ की और लेकिन फिर भी मेरे हिसाब से लोग जब तक इसकी आदत ना छूटे ना लोगों से तो हम उस लेवल पे जितना भी कुछ कर लें अगर लोगों के मनवृत्ति में है कि यार ये काफ़ी कन्वीनियंट है अभी ये मैं लेकर जाऊंगा अगर बारिश हो जाए तो भीग जाएगा यार इसके ऊपर प्लास्टिक डाल दो लेकिन इस एक्चुअली अगर सोचे तो कोई बड़ी बात नहीं है अगर भीग भी गया तो ऐसा क्या हो जाएगा यार उसको थोड़ा हम बचा के रखेंगे एक ज़माना था जब प्लास्टिक नहीं बनता था उस तरह से और फिर भी दुनिया अच्छी खासी चल रही थी तो अभी ये कन्वीनियंस जो एक दो यू नो मिनट की कन्वीनियंस के चक्कर में हम लोग एक ऐसी चीज़ की ईजाद कर चुके हैं सिंगल यूज़ प्लास्टिक जो होता है जो कभी डिकम्पोज नहीं हो पाता है तो वो एक बहुत बड़ा हैज़र्ड है तो ये हमें अपने सिस्टम से निकालना है मैं अपने लाइफस्टाइल में पूरी कोशिश कर रहा हूँ कि मैं जितना हो सके सिंगल यूज़ प्लास्टिक अवॉइड करूँ तो इस तरह के जैसे ये मिल गया तो अभी आपके पास ये पे, ये कपड़े का बैग है तो ये आप गाड़ी में रख लो तो कभी आप केमिस्ट से या कहीं से अगर आप कुछ खरीदारी कर रहे हो तो इस बैग में आप डाल दो उसके अंदर उससे ना बजाय कि वो प्लास्टिक दे आपको अगर छोटा आइटम हाथ में पॉकेट में डाल दो और आपके हाथ अभी दुखने लगे हैं तो मैं ज़्यादा बात नहीं करूँगा थैंक यू सो मच